All right, all right. I think we are we are live. What is going on, guys? Welcome to the video. My name is Brian Olenek, and this is going to be a review on how to start your own cupcake business. If you're looking at this because you want to build a business to be your own boss, quit your job, provide better for your children, or retire your husband, your wife, uh, whatever that you know passion is for you, this is the right video. All right, I'm going to share with you critical information, having started. A couple different types of businesses including this okay um, to say the least I did actually try this and it can be as simple as you know once you go out to the grocery store you got to look at wholesale priced items so you can actually make a profit so you want to look for deals at grocery stores basically you want to go to wholesalers you want to buy ingredients you can bake your cupcakes bake your goodies um, at home and then in turn you can sell them now the thing is when you're operating out of your home Alright, if that's what you're kind of thinking of doing, first off, operating on your home, you have to have home health inspection do a complete routine uh, through everything in your house to make sure that it's clean so that you can actually operate because you can't just operate by selling things out of your house. It has to be cleansed, um, it has to be up to date, it has to be functioning in a way that meets the standards of your state, your city, okay, to operate from home. Um, when it comes to a uh, store setting, all right, if you lease out or buy out a store setting, you can do it that way. Um, it's just going to cost you a little bit more, obviously, rent, leasing, monthly, yearly, okay, you got to keep that in mind. But that, in essence, is how you can get going. And the whole idea uh, that can separate yourself above the competition is making your cupcakes unique. How do you do that? Custom. Make custom different cupcakes. Make custom different baked goods. All right. And you want to stick to your brand. You want to make a brand name out of yourself so everyone knows and refers to you as someone who's different, not like the rest. So I hope that makes sense. That, in an essence, is how you can get going. Um, just finding a wholesaler is really the biggest part. And that way, you can mark up um, things that you make and create at a retail price that's fair, where you can turn a profit that can actually produce you a four-figure, five-figure income. But you got to keep in mind with cupcakes, it's a little bit lower of an income bracket because you're not dealing with like a hundred or a thousand-dollar product. You're dealing with um, like a five-dollar product, a five, five to ten-dollar product, a five to ten-dollar cupcake, which is still pretty expensive. So you got to keep in mind, um, you got to be producing a lot of volume when it comes to this business model. You got to make hundreds of sales per month if you want to maintain at least a four to five-figure monthly income income not sales so I hope you enjoyed this video I hope that makes sense to you that is really the simple newbie form of how you can get one going if you have any questions comment below um, if you'd like to you know learn more information about building a business I've got some additional tips I'm going to share with you here you can take this or leave it but this is going to be for those of you who are really wanting to build a business and income to be your own boss if you're wanting to do this to quit your job that's really what you're looking for it doesn't really necessarily have to be a cupcake business but if you're looking to just really quit your boss I've got a lead on it, throw you away, and my story and experience with this is completely generic. You can apply it in any form or fashion. Um, but if you follow me here for a second, what happened with this, specifically my experience, goes back over the last year, year and a half, and I actually quit this business model along with a couple other traditional business models, um, supplies, equipment, employees, baking all the time. When I was sick and when I wanted to take a vacation, I made no income because I couldn't produce, all right, which is something you got to keep in mind. If you're not producing, you're not making money. So I didn't like that type of business model, which goes with the cupcake business, unless you have it franchised out. So I quit it. And I came across an individual who was making a ridiculous, ludicrous amount of money. <laughs> I won't even say the number in this video. They're just making more money every month than I was making about two years. Um, so a lot of money. And they're traveling all the time, building and maintaining their income. And because they were doing this through the internet, okay, through systems online, right from their laptop, being able to pick up travel, build their business and income at the same time, began to model and copy them, actually reached out to them on Facebook in less than about 90 days after that point. Working like a dog chewing on a bone, all right, I was able to create a full-time income business for myself. Working part-time, um, I share that with you, not necessarily the results, okay, I share that with you because of the principles behind those results, which is if you want to build a business to be your own boss, create your own time, freedom, leverage, flexibility, never work for another person again, without having to worry about the bills at the end of every month, I would encourage you, learn and look into building a business online. It's the most leveraged, profitable business model you could tap into in today's day and age where you don't need supplies, equipment, employees. You can use the internet, your laptop, and do everything right from your computer and travel without being on it all day long, all right? Not talking about being a zombie on your computer all day long, but actually doing that without that overhead. And uh, best tip I'll leave you with though, regardless of the business and approach you decide to go down, connect with someone who's already building a business in a way that can help you get the results that you want. And on the internet especially, there's a lot of noise out there, so many different businesses you could be a part of. I would encourage you to find someone who's already doing it, 
in a way that can help you get the results that you want and model and copy them and take massive action. So as simple as it sounds, as cliche as it may sound to some of you, all right, it really can be that simple, all right? It will save you a lot of blood, sweat, and tears, and some of you will be like, oh, it's too big, good to be true. Um, if that's the case, then business is not right for you, okay? If you've got that mentality, a job is right for you. Maybe that's too good to be true. So I hope you enjoyed this. <laughs> for those of you who didn't get offended, and, um, you know, if you'd like to learn more information about building an income and business online, if you're coachable, trainable, you're willing to learn some things, you want to learn to do this to, you know, quit your job, be your own boss, travel, build an income at the same time, whatever that passion is for you, connect with me on my site, check it out, it's 123marketingtips.com, I'll put a link in the description below, and I will personally connect with you there, and I'll see you on the beach of the world, take care.